4,800 young people currently uh, we've identified as being homeless or facing homelessness, which equates to around 25% of the entire youth LM homelessness population in the UK. And those figures have come from research that the Albert Kennedy Trust carried out two years ago. What, what we find as an organisation is that LGBT youth homelessness isn't, isn't talked about. It's, homelessness we can see, especially in Manchester and all of our big cities, is increasingly becoming a problem. But the issue of LGBT youth homelessness is not something that people talk about often enough and when we do talk about it overall the, the first reaction we get is genuine shock because people can't believe in you know in the 21st century in 2017 that young people are being forced onto the streets simply for being brave enough to come out so at the Albert Kennedy Trust we really believe that this is the biggest crisis facing the LGBT community in this country. It needs to be talked about, schools need to be talking about it, faith groups and churches need to be talking about it, parents need to be talking about it, people, but the one thing that they should not be is, is, is afraid. They shouldn't be afraid to talk about it and they shouldn't be scared of, of, of having an LGBT um, son or daughter. Um, it's not a reason for anyone to, to, be, to be thrown out onto the streets. We, we, we firmly believe that a young person should not have to face a choice between a safe home and being who they are.